we gotta do this because I gotta go to bed, man. I'm tired. So, play story, chapters. Still working our way through story mode. Still working our way through all the alternate scenes in story mode. Uh, the last video was two chapters. This video is gonna be two chapters. We're gonna try this Catwoman cyborg thing. And later on, fast forward to the Aquaman and Black Adam one, and then that will just leave the big bad Batman ending, which hasn't been done. We'll do that for yet another recording, which I may not get to tonight because I am tired and I got to go work in the morning. So, skip movie, Catwoman, a burst. <laughs> he just fired at her and ran off. Oh, I'm gonna leave a scar. Um. Hey, you know, the crazy thing is that now that I know the story, now that I know what's going on, I don't actually have a lot to say during these chapters for characters that I don't really care for. Um. Catwoman's cool, and actually she's really sweet in this game. Um. Her trait, those little scratches that are down there, uh, every time you do, she's got, uh, I don't know how to do it, but that, yeah. That is her cat dodge, and every time you land it, or you just land certain moves, you get a scratch down there, and then you can press the button any time to do this sweet combo. Uh, which is kind of how it worked in the previous game, but it's just a lot better IMHO this time around. Ow. All right. Sure did a number on you. So that was Catwoman. <laughs> I love the falling back in ones where it's like they got their butts whooped. Your girlfriend's a real man eater. You got hit by her Martha super. Gave us so many memories, Selena. Bewitching guards, late night poker, mandatory shock therapy. Oh, that's right. You were spared. Thanks to your billionaire boy toy. I didn't ask for special treatment. To hell with this pity party. You're just dying to hurt me, aren't you, Tin Man? Very. It won't bring back what you lost, especially below the waist. <laughs> Poor Harley smelled the wrong roses, and now she's going into shock. These scenes are all the same. Baby doll. We can't just leave her. I'm gonna mow you down. Oh, cyborg, we don't have to fight. Let's kiss and make up. I guess that is a little bit who uh, Ivy is, you know? It's kind of the man-eater type, but it, uh... It kind of gets my goat when, like, a female character, like, all she can do in a story is make, you know, sexual or dating puns. Um... Not necessarily because I don't believe that they're lady killer, or I guess man-eater types of women, like that's far from the truth. It's just that none of the other guys are having like, unnecessary sexual tension with any other characters in the game. All the dudes in the story are like, uh, we got bigger fish to fry right now, the world's at stake. And every girl's like, OMG, what's Batman really like? Uh, so even this plot point that's like, you know... Cyborg really about to give it to Poison Ivy here. You know, all she's got in retort is a... Uh, a double entendre about making out, you know? Because, uh, again, that's her gift. She's gonna... With her kiss, she has pheromones and all that, so it flies with her. But there's, like, a lot of dog dog Catwoman has in her clashes and things like that. It's just, uh... That's how you do the techno tackle. Got it. Did I land his super? I think so. Just in case I didn't. Here's a show. I don't know. We're entering an age where I feel like we're getting uh, a little mixed up in terms of like actually what feminism is and what isn't feminism in terms of like writing. Yeah, but yeah, but who cares? Uh. 
You know, another thing I think it's glad that they, they managed to write into the story that I think is subtle is that all the regime members, all the remaining regime members, which there's really only like three of them, are, uh, you know, very clearly demonstrated to still be on board with killing. Alright, alright, you're crazy. Um, you know, it's a pivotal moment in the first game that Superman kills the Joker, and then after that he's just on board with killing people, and you're always like, Oh my god, Superman's killing again! But... Brainiac collects the best and discards the rest. Black Canary and Arrow, definitely, definitely not. not the best. So mean. <laughs> uh, I but. I over you any day, Victor. Here we are. Now we see they managed to put scenes in the story mode of all the new regimers, uh, which is like Cyborg, Wonder Woman, Black Adam obviously doesn't give a crap about killing people. Uh, but also Robin, I said him twice, uh, Cyborg, that are all, they're all on board with killing now. Um, I guess just to establish that just the tenets of the Justice League have, have changed. Now they are the Injustice League, and, uh, they're Wait, just on board. Are. Make sure no one follows us. Of course, this may all be meaningless hey. dialogue, because... Please. I don't know if I'm gonna make you guys watch through this again. I may not even split these up into two videos, I may just do one and one. It's too quiet. A little too rough. Bogies, and they're not bats. <laughs> I told Grog you were loyal to the bat. He called me paranoid. At He's least a monkey. He what do you when expect? I said Batman would not relinquish his cave so easily. Soon, not just this place, but all of Gotham will be mine. Catwoman? I've got business with Ben. Of all the ways to torment the bats, hurting you is one of my favorites. Yet you've never broken me. <laughs> That's true. He did get around to breaking Batman a bunch of times by this point in the canon. Ow. I think even during the build up of uh, Injustice 1. At some point, Bane got around to even breaking Batman. Ah, oh, it's the air one, okay. Ow. There we go. I know combos. How do you do or sure you can? Oh, that's the whip. That's the dodge. Oh. Sure you can. There we go. There's gotta be a cute name for that. Alright. Oh, Bane powers. Really good animations on his wrestling moves in this game. A lot of uh, NetherRealm Studios games do a really bad job of, uh, I don't even know how to get there that fast. I guess I can use the... <laughs> That'll do the damage to finish you. Was that as fun for you as it was for me? I murdered Deadshot. About damn time. System still running. You think he's supposed to be like kind of awkward because he's half robot? Clean power source. Something Brainiac can't touch. Or if that's just bad writing. Generators. That should do it. Because at this point, everybody's like such good friends that they. Nobody thinks it's weird. Anybody's quirks is like she's dressed like a cat, you know. Has a secret admirer. But your humanity. He's half robot. He probably smells funny. Interesting thought. Just one problem. I'm a team player, and humanity, that's my team. But you are capable of so much more. <laughs> 
as I mentioned in uh, another video, one of the conclusion videos of the four, uh, Grid, who emerges here, is actually not available if you just buy the game, because games suck now. Um, but if you link to the stupid mobile game, you get him for free. Apparently liberated from my good looks and charm, too. And he, uh... We need that backup power. Now. Yeah, I guess Catwoman goes and so, figures it uh, out. Grid, this mirror match is weird for you as it is for me. For years, I dwelled as a subroutine within your system. An anomaly. I never fathomed an existence outside you. Now, I realize my perfection. And your obsolescence. Alright. I do like that you said mirror match. Techno tackle. It's a techno tackle. Stop shooting. Or stop tackling. I will shoot. Shoot, 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 shoot. I hate that it keeps robbing me of uh That's what I was gonna do. And I whiffed. Give me a droid. Give me a droid. I don't have my droid. His trade takes forever. Launch. I remember how to play Cyborg a little bit. Oh, you got me. I thought I could clear it, but that's actually faster than I thought. That's actually my problem with the grid script skin right there. It has no dialogue. It doesn't say anything. Um, and like you can kind of tell with <laughs> that's a funny interaction between two invincible moves, uh, two throw moves. Not so perfect after all. Backup powers on. So yeah, Let's get this party you know, Grid is, uh, he's got Cyborg's move list, which is neat for a all robot character, but he has none of Cyborg's personality, and Cyborg's a pretty dry character to use in this game. So it really helps that he's just booyah and, like, has a bunch of cute dialogues and things like that. With Grid, like, when you play him, it feels so stale and so boring to me anyway, but maybe I'm just not a big Grid fan. Maybe if I just love Grid, I wouldn't play uh, so that's going to do it for these guys. We're going to take a quick skip here. Oh, skip my way. Also, I'm having an allergy attack. Yeah, not defiled, so cool. Such misplaced pride you have compared to my achievements. You are nothing, Adam. <laughs> I'm actually not a huge Gorilla Grodd fan, but it is really hard to argue with what they were able to accomplish with it. That's the problem. That sucks. Um, what they were able to accomplish with the uh, facial animations, you know, the ticks and things like that. Black Adam hits like a truck, man. He does a ton of damage, so... She, she can always do that with her time. I guess. It's a lot of meter I just wasted for zero game. Oh, I didn't do the good part. He grabs him and he shoots him with a bolt of light. Wow. How crude. But like, you know, that there, they managed to capture the, uh, I did the stupid throw wrong, but, it's all right. That's the cool part. Uh, you know, they're, uh, stop doing that. He's got a great transition on that stage. I guess you guys haven't seen any Come transition on, all you're doing is watching this. Face me. Tridented. I require no assistance. Psh, I didn't ask. I just like throwing my trident into people. That's what I do. I'm Aquaman. Time. 
Here comes the cavalry. Fitting that you two die together. The last of mankind's monarchs. What kind of ruler sacrifices his own people for Brainiac? My loyalty isn't to Brainiac or Gorilla City. It's to myself. I'll wait until that alien exposes his weakness and kill him with his ship. I will be unstoppable. All right. You're deluded, Grodd. <laughs> Black Adam is just gonna go punch him. Just gonna get to the bottom of this once and for all. How did it feel to lose your people, Aquaman? I didn't lose them. They were stolen from me. Semantics. It still happened. One, two, three. Oh, man. Didn't mean to do that. That's my trade button, which is not something you burn with this guy. Oh, you can't do those combos anymore. So how do you launch with him now? Stab, stabby, stab. Oh, that's the trade button. Stabby, stabby, stab, stab. stab. But, you know, it's like that one time, you just, you just stab, you just stab, 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 stab. Oh no, you can, uh, you can do from the deep, right. Yeah, so one, two, from the deep, the lightning. Oh, you escaped. Alright. I do that, uh, not that. There we go. Alright. Ah, stop it, arrow. Okay. It's like... And you gotta press a button to grab him and bring him back down. Uh, I'm pretty sure I showed you guys Black Adam and Aquaman Supers. He's just so mad about Atlantis. I kinda wanna hit the start button, but we're just gonna let this ride. You know, when I do it this way, we didn't even get to the part where, uh... Blue Beat? We thought you were dead. The Scarab's hard to kill. Batman told me you guys needed a hand. Consider me your sidekick. Come along. He snagged him from really far away. I gotta review the tapes, man. I thought that would show it, but... I don't know what happened to Blue Beetle. I've completely forgotten that scene, if that scene was even written. They were just like, you know. How does this work exactly? We imbue your trident with a spark of the rock's power. Ugh. When its full might is released, it will seek out your weapon. Your thoughts will guide the wizard's power to its final target. I am ready. What are you doing? My bidding. He's been hanging out in the Rock of Eternity. Agent to lead you here. Despite the power of his scarab, the boy was easily manipulated. Now, Heidi, kill them. He's a telekinetic ape. Black Adam. So many ways to kill you. The scarab's gimmicks are no match. For the rock of eternity. They are not. <laughs> I don't like to get into, uh, you know, theoretical superhero, you know, rhetorics a lot. But, uh. I have to believe that uh, Black Adam would be a little, little much for Blue Beetle. I mean, the alien technology is sweet, but seriously, dude's got the power of seven gods. Is it gods or seven? No, it's seven gods, yeah, which is nonsense, right? It's a nonsensical concept to begin with, but let's say it existed, you know. Zort. Oh, that was gonna be so great! Oh man. 
I hate dropping cool combos that I came up with on the fly. Ugh. Oh, that's the wrong one. This is super. Have a... I didn't reach. How about a gargoyle? That gargoyle didn't work. Ow. How about some lightning? Ow. Sorry, lightning. Or thunder, I guess. That was just a cross reference, perhaps. I required no assistance. A king, Grodd? You're a brute. A true leader serves his people. You only serve yourself. Yeah. Be that as it may, I will be the only one who leaves this cave. Says you, ape man. I got bad news for you. I read the script. Did he just crush Black Adam? <laughs> In their name, I will have justice. Aquaman, he can handle some stalagmites. You know, again, this goes back to kind of the uh, seven gods concept. I don't know how to do. Uh, there's like it's like two, three, and then the throw buttons. I think. I'm gonna try it. Hold on, hold on. Let me see if I can do it. Cause then you can like two, three. Oh no, he's hurting me badly. Stop. Ugh. Dukes. Ugh. Fine. Just stick the moves I know. How? I think that was gonna be it. You need teeth to eat. Don't get it. Like, is he saying he's gonna knock out all his teeth? Stop! Nope, that's not how you do it, so I'm not really sure. Is that like just one, two, one, two? No. One, one, two, one, two. You tried it, man. Oh, ow! <laughs> he's, he's stampeded on me again. I'm just running on to test my resolve. <sighs> yeah. Adam, strength of seven gods. Beat by rocks. Aquaman, strength of water pressure. He's got it. My bad. <laughs> had, a, had an Adam moment. So, we all saw what happens next. They murder the poor monkey. Uh, they're gonna kill that poor woman. As always, thank you for watching. Floobity floppity floop. And I hope you have a good day. Bye bye.